Hello again. Happy Wednesday evening. Now we are still seeing a couple storms on radar across mainly eastern portions of the coverage area about as far west as portions of Ronalds County, but mainly starting to exit the viewing area. There was a light severe weather threat for us, but looks like the majority of that is going to be past us through the coming hours. There are already some severe thunderstorm warnings getting closer towards the Dallas Fort Worth area and up to our east portions of Arkansas into North Mississippi and Western Tennessee, seeing some severe weather concerns. But for the most part, we're going to be staying dry for most of our areas through the night. Any rain that is left over is going to really start to exit the coverage area by sunrise tomorrow morning. We are going to be left over with a few additional clouds in the northeastern most areas and those southwestern most areas. Everybody in between looking to kick off Thursday with some mainly sunny skies. Now as we look towards the rest of the evening, temperatures looking to only get down towards the lower 80s, looking to hit 80 even in San Angelo overnight. Going to be a warm start to the Thursday, helping us get right back into the triple digits for yet another day across West Texas. Temperatures getting as low as 105 in places like Big Lake. That's going to be one of the relatively cooler spots for us. Getting into the one teens for locations like Comanche, looking to see a high of 113. 109 looking to be the high in San Angelo, 107 looking to be that high in Abilene tomorrow. Thanks to this, we've seen the excessive heat warning extended yet again through tomorrow at 9, likely going to get extended again for Friday as well. But for now, looking at that to last through Thursday evening at 9 o'clock, also have the red flag warning that has been extended as well for the entire coverage area. So along with this heat, still dealing with dry conditions, dry vegetation, gusty winds that could set us up for some potential wildfires in the, in the forecast. Now, even as we look towards next week into the weekend, possibly the start of that next week, this trend really not looking to let up. The Climate Prediction Center's latest 6 to 10 day outlook has us in this dark red 80% chance of above average temperature. So likely going to stay just how we are right now. Still looking at that chance for below average precipitation. So it's likely that the little bit of rain we're getting tonight is going to be all we're going to see for a while. As you can see on the seven day sunny skies, triple digit temperatures throughout the forecast period. The coolest days are going to be seeing a high of 105. Take that in. The coolest days over the next seven days are going to be between 104 and 105. Everything else is only up from there. I'll have more coming up later on, so make sure y'all